Hi everyone, my name is Julie Sebi. I write the Analytics Corner blog that focuses on data engineering, analytics, and visualization with Alteryx and Spotfire. You can find my site at the URL shown on the screen. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix a problem that I ran into with the Alteryx Report Text tool. If you copy and paste text from applications like Microsoft Word into the Report to Text tool, when you run the workflow, you'll find that it strips out punctuation. So I'm going to show you how to fix that problem. Before I dive into the problem and solution, I want to give a brief shout out to the new Alteryx Virtual Solution Center. Through the Solution Center, users can book appointments with Alteryx experts to help with workflow questions and problems. I've used it three times, once for this problem that we're working on today and twice for batch macros. Not only did each appointment solve my problem, but I also learned new tips and tricks that I otherwise wouldn't have discovered on my own. And note, this is not a sponsored post. The, the most I've ever received from Alteryx is a free pair of socks. So here is my workflow. Now obviously this is a stripped down version of what I was actually working on. I've simplified it so that we can focus on the problem. And I've also duplicated the workflow tools. The top set will show the problem and then the bottom set will show the solution as it's been applied. And I've already run the workflow. So originally I was trying to create an email with a personalized PDF attachment. I copied and pasted the email wording from Microsoft Word into the report text tool, which creates the email body, and then I used the browse tool to view the result. Had I not used the browse tool, I wouldn't have seen the problem until my email had already been sent out. You'll notice that I have two report to text tools. One says copy and pasted from Word, and one says typed into the tool. This is obviously where I copied and pasted from Word, but even after I figured out the solution to this problem, I started thinking about it and I realized that a lot of applications just don't like copy and paste. So I wanted to see if I would still have the same problem if I typed directly into the tool. And so I created another tool and another browse in order to see if there was a difference. So let's look at the detail on my report to text tool. This is my email body. And as you can see, there are quotations around the word, the company. And then I'm using three apostrophes, one after organization or in organizations, another in offices or companies, companies offices, and then again in companies offices. I've already run the workflow so we can see the result in my browse tool. And you'll notice that all of that punctuation is gone. Now there are two solutions to this problem and I'll go to my second set of tools to show them to you. Here you can see that to solve the problem, I actually just typed in double quotes around my double quotes, and I added another apostrophe next to the apostrophes that are getting stripped out. I missed that one. And if I run this, and now we go to it in the Browse tool, you'll see that the punctuation is retained. I don't lose any of the double quotes or any of my apostrophes. Now, the second solution to this is simply not to copy and paste from Word into the tool. If you type into the tool, then the punctuation is never stripped out. So typed into field, here you can see it's still there, and I didn't have to take any additional action. And you'll even notice it where I've made the correction that the quotes look a little bit different. They're just a little bit different between this application and Word. So all said and done, it's a pretty easy and simple solution. You might decide to copy and paste anyway if you're having to copy and paste a lot of data. If it's not very much, well then maybe typing in the tool is just the easiest thing. So please check out my YouTube channel and subscribe for future content. Thanks.